Hey streamers and welcome back to the WP Stream YouTube channel. I am so excited in this video to announce that we have now integrated with the BuddyBoss platform to allow live streaming directly from the front end via the BuddyBoss platform. So if you are um, aware of how WP Stream works, you'll know that live streaming has been happening from the back end by going to free to view live channels or all channels and creating a channel. But now with just the Buddy Boss platform and the theme, you will be able to go live as the admin and also as regular users through the front end. So let me demonstrate how to do this. So I'm going to the news feed. So this is the main page. This is where everything happens. But now I will first go to David's profile. So David is the admin of this website. You'll see there's the live video option now. So this is um, where you will go live. You select the channel. So I'm going for Dave's channel. And as you can see there, there's the channel control section. So you will first have to turn on your channel before you can go live. So as you can see, it is currently turning on. And once it is on, you have a few options. You can either go live using your webcam or you can do it using an external streaming app like OBS Studio. You can also check out the live statistics, statistics, view channel and share your channel. But now I'm going live using my webcam and I will click on start broadcast on the broadcast pop up. Once that's done, I will go back to my profile. And as you can see, here is the live stream. But if you go to the news feed, so the main page where everything happens, you'll also see the live stream over here. So yeah, that's how the admin can go live. But similarly, let's see how a regular user can go live. So I'm going in, I'm going to log in as a regular user for now with no permission as of yet. So if I go to the live video section, you'll see that this user does not have permission to live stream as of yet. So to change this, I will go back to my admin um, account, to David's admin account. And I will go to the back end. So you don't have to do this each and every time. Um, but if you go to WP stream settings and under general options and you pick each and every one of the uh, user roles allowed to broadcast, if you pick every single one of them and save changes, anyone who registers on your website can live stream. But if you just want specific users, you can pick one specific uh, role and assign this user to that specific role. So you only allow subscribers, for example, or contributors, make sure you assign the role and of course save changes. Now let's log out after we've done this, go back to Mandy's profile. And if we go to live video, you'll see that you can now live stream. Well, the regular user can live stream. So she has her channel. I am turning on the channel. And once again, the same instructions apply. I'm going live with my webcam or my regular user is going live. Um, start broadcast. And if the user goes back to their profile, they'll see the live stream over here once again. And of course, if they go to the main page, to the news feed where everyone can see what's going on, everyone can interact, the live stream will also be available on the home page on the newsfeed page. So of course the user can go to the user's profile and watch, but they can also do picture in picture and continue catching up with what's happening in the community. They can like the post, they can comment on their, the live stream, and they can also go full screen, enjoy the full screen experience and things like that. So yeah, that's it on how the live streaming integration works with the BuddyBoss platform. This has been newly implemented and we're so excited to announce this and to see how excited you are about this as well. So make sure you leave a comment down below. Let us know how many of you use the BuddyBoss platform and how many of you will try live streaming with the BuddyBoss platform. Thanks for watching. Bye.